Hayden and I'm the CEO of the Cook Islands Chamber of Commerce. In May last year, the Chamber recognised that contact tracing was needed in order to open up our borders with New Zealand. Our government at the time was busy focusing on the preparedness of our public health facilities, including the installation of a new PCR lab. The Chamber began researching what kind of contact tracing system would work here in the Cook Islands, which is a country where many of our vulnerable people do not have access to smartphones nor the internet. We found a system that was normally used to track attendees at conferences or universities and adapted it for our country. This involved issuing a QR card with a unique number to each user. The user fills out their contact details and tears off the card. Public locations download our software and have to their devices charged and ready for visitors and locals to tag in with their QR cards. That way, only the devices need to be smart. They don't even have to have the internet connected all the time, just once in a while, so the data can be uploaded to the secure database managed by our public health officials. The CookSafe system can pinpoint where you have been at a particular time and who may have been there at the same time. Contact tracing is all about increasing the speed in which you can identify contacts and places of interest, just in case of a suspected or diagnosed infection. This speed can literally save lives. The Chamber manages all of the user registrations and troubleshoots any issues with the devices. We also manage all of the promotion to ensure as many people as possible know about CookSafe and how to use the CookSafe system. We provide regular reporting to our government to let them know how many users are registered and how many tag-ins are happening. We have since also introduced Bluetooth technology with our CookSafe Plus app. This app also has interoperability with the New Zealand COVID tracing app. Both the New Zealand and Cook Islands Health Ministries would prefer people use the app of the country they are currently in. Used together, CookSafe and CookSafe Plus means we have a double layer of protection for our people and now the visitors from New Zealand who have been allowed to travel here since May 2021. The Chamber of Commerce, our government, the New Zealand Health Ministries and the New Zealand software developers have all worked together to provide the solution for us here in the Cook Islands. Mei Te Kimata, Thank you, Minuia. Thank you.